Good afternoon. Today is Tuesday, August 6th, and I just wanted to do a little update video on my sort of diet and routine over the past few days. So what happened was I was working Comic-Con in Tampa, and so when you're away traveling, you don't necessarily have the best um, options for nutrition. However, you are walking around the convention center doing like 20,000 steps a day. It doesn't really... Um, it doesn't help with the fact that you're not eating your proper nutrition, so you can be eating the wrong, like salty foods, higher sodium, even when you're trying to um, choose the healthiest options that are available to you. So I ate some pizza and some wings and some cake on the last day of the event, and you know, I ate it and I enjoyed it. And then the next, I was like, you know, tomorrow and, you know, over the next few days, I just need to get back on track and that's fine. So, you know, that's like hashtag live your life type of stuff. But it's very important to when you can make the conscious decisions to um, get your health and your diet and your nutrition and your exercise routines back on track. So the next morning I woke up, it was the last day before checking out, so I went to the gym. And I do a lot of, um, I've done all kinds of exercise in the past. I've done CrossFit, I've done, I do yoga, I do dancing, I do um, a number of different things. Stretching and sometimes I just get on a treadmill and do or do like a lot of full body workouts that just energize me so it's like to get the blood flowing so I do a lot of flow movement stuff and while working all muscles of the body at the same time so um, I'm thinking about creating a little workout guide and nutrition step-by-step um, -step detox plan and this is something that I'm doing for myself and I'm planning on sharing it with you just to see because it really helps me it always helps me get back on track helps bring my mind to clear focus it helps me feel better about myself feel more energized um, and just healthy you know it's about taking care of our bodies and our minds um, so we can feel good about waking up every day going through our days um, with joy and happiness so I'm gonna be putting that together and Today, yesterday, for example, post cake and pizza, I did the gym. I did um, a lot of, I always do a lot of lemon water and teas. And I also did, oh, I had a salmon salad and then I was still on the road. So I, then I did a falafel salad. And so that's like what I ate yesterday, but I did indulge on a magic bar from Dats, which is like the best little bar that I get every time I go to Tampa. I think it's gluten-free, it's not vegan, so I think there's some dairy in there. It's like one of those like everything bars. So fucking good. So I ate that, felt kind of bad about that one because it was more like I'm avoiding my discipline, but also there's tradition and also it's a subconscious pattern. So this morning it was funny because the mind program that I'm doing day five of the audios was actually talking about, do you have any healthy habits that you're trying to change? And so last night I was up till 6 a.m. writing out the fact that I'm going to be creating these programs on the detox program, a physical body and nutrition and a mind clearing. And um, then that was the message for today's video. So I thought that was really funny. So today I took some photos of myself while I was at the gym, which I do not like necessarily putting my body out there. I just always felt like it was, um, it draws the wrong attention, but I'm trying to change the way I think about it in the sense that I'm trying to elevate, heal, and regenerate my body to its um, optimum health um, because like eating pizza is not healthy. It's not about YOLO and fuck it mode. Like, yes, it's okay to enjoy it sometimes, but it's also like the chemicals and the processed ingredients that are going in there are going in your body and that's not good for you. It's not good for your cells. It's not what our bodies are made of. So it's about getting back to the right and raw nutrition so that your body can 
operate um, the way that it should and the way it's designed to. And so um, far today, right now, it's probably almost four o'clock. So I slept um, a good six hours. Um, got up at 12.30, did my morning meditation, which was day five of the audios of the TIP program. And then I went to the gym and I did um, some cardio on the treadmill. I did the stairs for the first time in a while, but it was really great because I like to run up the stairs um, and get the blood really pumping and flowing. And then I went into the yoga room, did a lot, put the music on, did a lot of like stretches and just getting this body like back into its energy. And then I went and did some back because I have been really working on my posture. So we'll be seeing some transformation um, with that as well. So all good and I'm about to go upstairs and eat an apple. So that's all I've had to eat today. And it's not because I really haven't felt hungry. Um, and we eat more food than we need to a lot of times. And so that's gonna be discussed in my programs, how much we probably need to eat, how much we overeat um, and the power and benefits of fasting. So I'm gonna be working up to a fast and a detox for myself. So if you'd like to come along that journey, then um, just keep an eye out. I'm gonna be posting everything pretty much on Instagram. Um, I guess maybe I'll transfer it over to Facebook. I haven't done anything there for a while. So that's just the update that's going on here and hope everyone has a great day. Thank <laughs> you.